Austin 316 says I just whipped your ass. As the king of the ring, I'm serving notice to every one of the superstars. They're all on the list, and I'm fixing to start running through all of them. Steve Austin's time has come, and that's the bottom line, because Stone Cold said so. Oh, wait a minute, look at that. Cheap shot. Oh, no. Stone Cold Spur. Oh, come there on. you go. Come on. Stone Cold is the best there is. As Stone Cold continued to scratch names off his superstar hit list, there was one name that had eluded Austin's sights. I'd like to use this chance to issue a challenge against one Bret the Hitman Hart. Bret Hart had been absent for the dawn of 316 and the man who had been raising hell all over WWE. If you put the letter S in front of Hitman, you've had my exact opinion of Bret Hart. I'm the best there is. I don't pay attention to a lot of talk. I'm the best there was. Especially when it comes from you. And I'm the best there ever will be. The hitman found himself in unfamiliar territory. The crosshairs of the Texas rattlesnake. The one thing that's been missing has been me. But the excellence of execution has never been one to back down from a challenge. In the Survivor Series... I will face Stone Cold Steve Austin. You're never going to get through with Stone Cold Steve Austin. You're going to have to kill me first, son. And that's the bottom line, and it's the truth. And if I can beat Stone Cold, then I will beat Stone Cold. The rest is easy pickings for the hitman. Son, if you think Stone Cold Steve Austin is a stepping stone, We'll watch the first step, cause it's a doozy. Will Bret Hart be able to prove once and for all that he is the best there is, the best there was, and the best there ever will be? We'll see who kicks whose ass. Or will Austin 316 stomp the hitman into exile? You ain't got what it takes anymore. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Coming down the aisle from Victoria, Texas, weighing 250 pounds, Stone Cold Steve Austin. And ladies and gentlemen, here it comes. The man who could unquestionably spoil the comeback attempt of Bret the Hitman Hart. You talk about qualifications, King. This man, Stone Cold Steve Austin, could ruin Bret the Hitman Hart's career. You know, JR, I saw Steve Austin a few years ago in the Sportatorium down in Dallas, Texas. And you could see the greatness, the potential greatness. It's all about attitude, then and now. An attitude, I might add, that is somewhat appreciated by this capacity crowd. And his opponent, from Calgary, Alberta, Canada, weighing 234 pounds, Brett. Hitman Hart! The Hitman, Bret Hart, looking to electrify this capacity crowd. And everyone, and I mean everyone, are on their feet. Well, he's back. He ain't no clown. He ain't no trash man. He's a fierce competitor. And so is Stone Cold Steve Austin. That's what it's all about, JR. Wrestling, competition, intensity, athleticism, and drama. And we're going to experience it all in this one match here tonight. Well, this should be quite the contest, Jerry. Stone Cold Steve Austin, Bret the Hitman Hart, finally going to meet one-on-one. -on -one. This is a rivalry 
that has been brewing for several weeks now. Well, you're right about that, JR. A long time coming, and it's finally here. Stone Cold Steve Austin, the rattlesnake, going against the best there is, the best there was, the best there ever will be. This should be great. Brett the Hitman Hart, the consummate wrestler, scientific, fundamentally sound. Austin likes to brawl. Oh, likes yeah. To, likes to fight. Oh, look at this. Look at this stare down. Are either one of these guys going to be intimidated, JR? I don't think so. Austin trying to get into Hart's head. I don't think that's going to happen. From oh, the look at that. oh, my goodness. Oh, you're number one in the heart of Stone Cold Steve Austin. Here they go. The black heart of the Texan. Bottom no elbow tie up. And it's Brett the Hitman Hart. Well, had the advantage momentarily. Austin now reverses it. Referee asks for a clean break. Whoa. Uh oh. I wouldn't want to be the referee in this match, would you, JR? Absolutely not. Uh oh. I think Timbers are going to flare really quick. Well, the, the tension, you can feel the tension when these men came to the ring. You knew this was going to be special. What if Stone Cold Steve Austin used the sharpshooter to make Bret Hart submit? Collar and elbow tie up. Collar and elbow tie up being applied. They are locked up. This is intense right here. Man, they're going at it here. Look at this. Yeah, Bret Hart, he won't quit. He doesn't know how to quit. Uh oh, what are we gonna see here? And folks, it don't get more painful than that. Great offense by Bret Hart. Wow, Austin's just opening a can. Bret Hart being overwhelmed here. Goes to work on that neck. You have to wonder, as this match wears on, whether or not the effects of those devastating holes and blows of Steve Austin will take their effect on Bret Hart considering the hitman was off for six months. And for some reason, it's been an obsession with Austin and Bret Hart over the years. And what an opportunity for Steve Austin to make a name for himself at the expense of Bret the Hitman Hart. It sort of reminds me of the, of the gunslinger days. Everyone wants to be the fastest draw. You're right, JR. Everybody wants to notch their gun. Steve Austin with the offense. I don't think you're going to see a lot of high flying or a lot of risk taking in this matchup, JR. Oh, I don't know. I think he might see it all. Well, oh, look at this. Stone Cold Steve Austin thinks he's in charge here, JR. Yeah, but I think that Bret oh. Hart's got other ideas. Hart trying to get control of the match now. Oh, Bret Hart going for another bulldog. Ross off the counters. Oh. There's Hart sturdily first into the turnbuckle. Oh, man. Look at this, JR. Both men down.
Showboating. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Bret Hart reversing it. Incredible. Two. He's pulling out all the stops tonight. Calgary's own Bret Hart looks to be in great shape. He had a personal trainer to help himself get ready. Yeah, you're right. All of his old nagging injuries should be fully healed at this point. Four. A spectacular counter. Oh, my. Steve Austin. Oh, out here you have to be able to think on your feet lightning Six. fast. One mistake, one moment of hesitation, and you could find yourself in a world Seven. of hurt. can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with anybody. Well, we're on the move here. He's going for the top turnbuckle. Takes to the air. Both men are fatigued, JR. Both men are hurt. This is a war. Well, they say that fatigue makes cowards of us all, but neither one of these men are cowards. How do you like the athleticism, folks? This is what it's all about. One. Two. Three. He'll be feeling the effects of that for a while. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the oh. ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous oh. objects. Six. Oh, watch out. He sees it. Oh, nice counter. Narrowly avoiding the attack. can only absorb so much of that. Oh, man. How do you stand after an attack like this? Oh, wait. Nice reverse. Great offense by Steve Austin. Somehow, he's kicked it into another gear here tonight. This might not end well. Oh, my. Steve Austin. He's looking at it. Austin, no! He's in rare form tonight. Hey, this may very well be it. He's in the driver's seat, and he knows it. And the net breaker connects. the reversal. Diving into his bag of acrobatic tricks. Pulling out all the 
the stops tonight. Can he take what's been working here and use it as strategy down the line? Incredible move by Steve Austin. Oh, man, what a matchup, King. This has been physical all the way through. But I tell you, I think Stone Cold Steve Austin's got to be asking himself, what does he have to do to beat Bret Hart? Can he do it? Oh, look at this. Austin with that version of the Million Dollar Dream but it's countered by Hart. Hart's ah! shoulders down and broke the Hitman Hart, countered Austin, and pins the rattlesnake. Hart has earned a shot now as the WWE Champion. Man, oh man, Stone Cold Steve Austin had that, had that finishing maneuver locked in, but he wouldn't let go when, when Hart was on the ropes. That's what really cost him the victory. The Million Dollar Dream cost Austin maybe a million dollars. This rivalry is far from over. I guarantee you that, my guy.